Hello everyone, welcome in Learn CHE. Today we are going to discuss about how to use index. Index which we see in the last of our books. So this is an index and today I will tell you how to use this index. Many times students do not know how to use index. So today I will tell you how to use index. Okay. So I have a book of unit operations of chemical engineering. Right. So suppose I want to study about the Reynolds number right so what can i do instead of like searching like that where is a reynolds number where is a reynolds number like suppose that like that okay in fluid mechanics where is a reynolds number what can i do i can simply go here in index and because reynolds number start with r capital r alphabet so i'll go with r here is R. now I have to find the Reynolds number right so what I will do I will just go with the Reynolds number so this is a Reynolds number I can you can see here this is a Reynolds number and here is a pages right this is a topic and this is a pages where Reynolds number have discussed so 53 and 62 so I will simply go to 53 right where I will go I will go to the 53 So here we go and in 53 here you will see the Reynolds number right. So here is like that you can study about the any particular topic which you want to study and which you want to study particular topic so you can search like this via index help okay. Now suppose if I want to study about the hazen Pauli's equation right in fluid mechanics we study about the hazen Pauli's equation to determine the pressure drop so what can I do I can simply go with the alphabet H okay so with alphabet H I can just simply find out the hazen Pauli's equation so in 920 so if I'll go with 920 so I'll find the hazen Pauli's equation at here you can see the hazen Pauli's equation so okay so 920 this is the okay so this is the benefit of using the index how to use index okay